somebody please tell me why I just washed my baby's clothes and now they're on this dirty ass table. <laughs> hey y'all. Um, I'm back from the store and you know, I thought you guys might be up for an in the microwave grocery haul from Kroger. I think I spent, I left the receipt in the car. I think I spent like $70 on all this stuff, which is pretty decent. So let's just start with the first thing that I see. And I got some cinnamon toast crunch rolls. I don't know why I've been into like the specialty versions of the cereals that I like, but I have, so I got those. I got some devil's food cake mix because breastfeeding will have you with a sweet tooth. I got so many packs of these. 90 second rices because they're just helpful when it comes to cooking for me. So I got some roasted chicken. Um, what's this? Whole grain brown rice. I think I got like three of these because I like making fried rice at home. It's one of my favorite things to eat. And then I got red beans and rice. Those help me out so much. Um, I typically am a make anything from scratch type of girl, but rice specifically, you have to kind of watch it, be near it, and these days I just don't have the time to do that anymore, so those help me out a lot, just having those that I can pop in the microwave and, you know, they'll be done, so that's that. Then I got some plant-based breakfast sausage. I got some dairy-free vanilla ice cream because I want to make um, um, brain fart <laughs> milkshakes at home. Because again, sweet tooth problems. I got some all-purpose disinfectant cleaner that is baby and pet safe. Because um, before we had her, we used to just use like you know, pine saw, fabulosa, whatever. But once I was pregnant, like towards the end of my pregnancy and moving forward, I wanted to switch over to something that was a lot safer to be inhaling and breathing in with a baby. Um, so I obviously want to keep that going while she's still little at least. Um, I got some Sprite. I got oat milk, unsweetened, please. And I also got, um, uh, I also got almond milk, unsweetened, please. <laughs> we got through so much milk in this house, it's insane. I had to put some stuff away so I could have more space to get some more stuff out. <laughs> um, I got some more, this is so hard doing this with one hand. <laughs> I got some more mango chunks for smoothies. Then I got a crap ton of chicken because we've been eating a bunch of chicken. So I got some thin sliced chicken breasts. All of these were on sale, I think. I got some chicken thighs. And I got some chicken drumsticks. Got some fudge brownie mix. Got some Kool-Aid jammers. I got some Nesquik mix for the milkshakes. I got some chocolate syrup for the milkshakes. Some Tony C's. And some squeezable natural grape jelly. And that's it. For 70 something dollars, I don't think it was that bad. Before coupons, it was like a hundred and something, I think. And then once I put the coupons in, it brought it down to, I think it was 70 10 was my total. So yeah, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. So I am 15 weeks postpartum and I wanted to show you guys my body. Um, this is where we are. I still have a ways to go, y'all, but I at least wanted to show y'all we're about to go for a walk. So I got some stretch marks going on or whatever, but hey, we're going to get it down y'all. It's just hard to find time to actually work out. So like walks are what work best for me. So yeah, 
we're about to go for an hour long walk and um hopefully we're going on these every day we can slim her down good risings good people <sighs> hello from my postpartum hair loss honey this is anyhow and my skin has been like peeling in postpartum so like this isn't even ash this is like my skin peeling but i'm talking quiet because i need to try to get some stuff done my baby girl's taking a nap um i'm gonna try to do the dishes super quietly <laughs> and i'm also doing laundry so let's get into it okay honestly i am trying to figure out when the fuck the sink became a trash can like why is there a disposable fork in the sink why is there a water bottle in the sink why is there a water bottle cap in the sink like i'm just hey y'all so my baby is pulling my hair <laughs> but i bought her some more um hangers because the hangers that she currently has they're just for tops um so i don't have anything to hang her pants up with thank you for letting go so i got her some more hangers and i use wooden hangers for her because her room is like this black, gold, natural, woodish. The theme in here is like modern, sunflowers, bumblebees type of vibe. So I got her these hangers and I figured that even though they are kids hangers since she's a baby, um, I would be able to put two pair of pants on them um because they scoot in or whatever to adjust but again she's still a baby so you can like scoot the things in like this or pull them out like that but i'm thinking that since she's a baby i can put one pair of pants here and then another pair here and just organize them by color so i want to wipe these down with um a dress disinfectant wipe and then start hanging up her bottoms I'm so excited because I already was cleaning today so I'm really excited I get to do this Still tipping out the old 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 tip